Hi, I'm Kieran Akal and I'm the owner and founder of Akal Chai Rum. And I'm here today to present you our newest product, which is our signature Chai Rum smoking kit. The kit comes in this box, which is an eco-friendly package. Let me open the box and show you what's inside. Once you open up your box, you'll get a little message from John and myself thanking you for your purchase. In the box, there will be two cards, a torch instruction kit, but then also a card that tells you about each of the different types of flavors of wood that are in the box, a little bit about their history, a little bit about the experience of using it with the rum. On the flip side of the card are the instructions for using your smoking kit and a QR code that will connect you to the Chai Rum radio station that allows you to get continually curated musical accompaniment to your Chai Rum drinks at home. So let me show you all again what's in the box so that you have a clear idea. First of all, you have your culinary grade torch. The torch comes with a flame adjuster, and most importantly, with a child lock kit for safety. The second thing is that you get your three blocks. In this instance, we're using three flavors, cedar, cherry, and maple, each one modulating the rum in a different way and making for a new experience. The blocks are made in California by our own atelier. They are organic grade wood that is sustainably sourced for every tree that is cut down, three or replanted. They're cut along the grain in a particular way and kiln dried it so that they contain no harmful ingredients and no insects and that they burn more evenly, creating a better aromatic smoke experience. And last but not least, you get a beautiful velvet pouch that you can keep your blocks, your torch and your, inst your instruction booklet in uh, whilst you're not using it. So I'm going to demonstrate today how you do this. It takes about 7 to 10 seconds, if you can believe it, to do this. And so I'm just going to show you how we can make this happen. Um, the first thing I'm going to do is get a plate or a saucer of some kind that you can use to protect your surface. Take your block and place it onto the surface. In this way, you're not going to catch anything on fire at your house. The next thing is to select your glass that you're going to use. I've put a little selection here for you today to show you some of the favorites that we have. You can use a tasting glass, a double old fashioned, a brandy snifter, or a stemmed wine glass. It depends on your style and what, how you feel you wish to serve it. Today, I'm going to use the brandy snifter. To ignite the wood and to create the smoke, simply take the child lock off, and then you press your torch, so a couple of times, an intense blue flame will appear, place it onto the block. The block will begin to show you a small flame after seven to 10 seconds, place the glass over it, extinguish, and there you see the smoke is filling the glass. One thing to note, these blocks can be used several times. Even over the charred areas, the more you smoke it, the more aromatic it gets. Uh, and it'll give you about 100 to 120 drinks uh, at a time. Um, once the glass is smoked, you turn it over, take your rum, pour it into the glass. You can do this with or without rocks. You can also do it with a cocktail and serve. This is what we call rum a la boucanet in the West Indies or smoked chai rum. Cheers.